gang, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tay, and I'm here with my first natural hair video. Y'all yeah. know I don't be getting on YouTube looking natural, natural. I have no eyebrows not filled in. I'm looking woo, child. The ghetto. Um, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Make sure you subscribe so that you can become a part of the most royal gang in the land, honey. That's the Regal Gang. Um, so today we are trimming my hair. I am starting on um wash conditioned and deep conditioned hair. Um I did detangle before I deep condition is four sections and then I'm gonna blow dry my hair. Let me just scroll. And I'm not gonna record ooh, I'm not gonna record um the whole blow dry process because that's not what you're here for. You're here to you cut my hair. Um this will be my first Girl, these these clips was from the dollar store. This will be my first time trim, trimming my hair. I'm, I'm I'm very nervous, honey. Not because I don't believe in myself, but because I'm gonna have to cut my hair. Like y'all y'all probably gonna be like, really, sis? But my last trim was of uh, in February of 2018, sis. I know, it's so sad. I'm not sure if y'all could see from the camera. But my ends are just crazy. And they're probably gonna look real bad when it's blown out. Putting on my hair before I blow it out is the Shea Moisture. Oops. Shea Moisture. Sorry, you guys can't really see. I don't want to drop the conditioner. The Shea Moisture Strengthen and Restore Leave In Conditioner. Just a little bit. Okay. It's not gonna focus, but just a little bit. Um, okay, probably a little bit more. I don't want to put too much, too much um, product, little tiny, just a tiny bit, like literally that, that much of shea butter. This is the heat for a second that I use. Yeah, pretty sure y'all seen this in the beauty supply store. Not sure if it's the best for your hair, but we got to use it. Um, I didn't mean to put that much. So we just go ahead and I also don't want to use too much of this either. So here I am detangling my hair with the white tooth comb once again, so there are no snags when I start to blow dry my so hair. This is the blow dryer that I'm using. It's by Hot Tools. Hot Tools. And honestly, this will be my first time using this using this blow dryer on my hair. Okay, are halfway done. A minute, honey, ball air, sweetie. Where? It's like, no. Child, so this is my hair blown out. Oh, I'm tired. Now I'm going to place a picture of what the last time oh. I thoroughly blow dried my hair. It's a big difference, honey. Um, But also remember that I did not have the comb attachment. Uh, I'm only doing the bare minimum of a trim because number one this is my first time number two i really don't want to cut my hair i hate that the camera has to be on an angle but um yeah so just know while i'm actually cutting it i'm not gonna be <laughs> looking at y'all the people used uh try is this comb break on me uh fine tooth comb to kind of like figure out where to cut and honestly, I'm gonna say this too. I'm not really too like pressed on how I cut it. I'm not gonna cut it on an angle though. But I'm, I don't want my hair out anyway, so I'm not looking for a specific shape. So I'm, I think I'm just gonna cut like down, like like have my hair down and then just cut across. I'm doing the most tension here. So I just think I'm gonna cut it off. Oh my god, I did it! I did it. I cut it. Yo, know, look how much I've cut off. <gasps> I'm pretty sure I could have cut off more, but also, like, I don't know about it, sis. 
it does feel smoother though. It honestly, I think that was perfect because it feels smoother. All right, so we're moving on to the next section. Okay, so what I'm gonna cut is like exactly where those ends are that are like ridiculous. Next time, this one. About the same amount, honestly. Like, I'm not cutting off a lot. So, if you all think from my first time trimming my own hair, I'm doing pretty well. I'm just about to do it, honey. Oh yeah, I actually didn't cut that close, y'all. I cut, you see how much I have left? Like the last section um, that I have for this half of my head. So let me just cut it right here and that's gonna be what it is. What do y'all think, y'all? What do y'all think? Did I just make a big mistake? Oh wow. For the first half of my head. Don't know how to feel. But this would have, oh child. And your hair is uneven. You look dusty. It does feel better um, combing through my hair. But I think for my first time, this isn't bad. It's not bad. Compare it to the side that is not trimmed. Well, it's, it's not that much of a difference, but I just feel like it is. Like, it's really not that big of a difference though. So I did go faster on this side of my head. I also cut more off. Um, I cut a lot out of the video just so that it could be faster. But I think I did much better on this side of my hair than the other side. And <laughs> I believe I go to the last section of my hair and show you what I cut off. The last section. And I honestly can't say that I probably did cut a much more off than I did on this side. Not a lot. But like I cut more off on this side than the other side, I think, just because I'm like Taylor. Listen. Listen, sis. You get the hair kit? Would you rather have health or length? Which one? So I'm just cutting off where it just does not look healthy to me. Um, but I do also feel like I went faster on this section. I think just because I'm like tired and plus I'm being like realistic. Let me cut it right here. Um, Probably a bit more than what I need to. It definitely feels better. Let's see. So you can see the back, and then now I did kind of a turnaround thing um, on my snap, so I'll place that in there so we can compare what the back is looking like. And so the total amount of hair that I cut off in this pro in this process is this much. Honestly, for the amount of hair on my head, that's not that much. But honestly, also like this side looks a lot more even. So this side, yeah, it is a little longer. Um, I'm not gonna go back and try to fix it because I just don't feel like doing all of that. I'm very proud of myself for doing it. And going to healthy hair is 2020. So thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you when I see you.